Hi everyone, welcome back to Brook Valley Life. Today we're going to be doing another review and today it's going to be a reciprocating saw from Zito stroke Einhell and it's the PCX 18 volt version. Please enjoy. Hi everyone, welcome back and as I've said today we're going to be looking at uh, a quick review on the Azito uh, reciprocating saw and from their PCX range. Now <clears throat> again this uses the same batteries as all of the other 18 volt PCX range from Azito stroke Einhell. We get out here in the uh, back of beyond we get Azito which is an Australian brand um, we're in New Zealand so we get what they get um, really good price I'll put the price up uh, well somewhere around the screen area so you can see how much I paid for it it comes as it is this was just a skin I've got batteries anyway so um, didn't need one um, it came with a blade now the blades aren't that good <clears throat> um, Yes, they do the job when they you first use them. They cut through stuff, cut through wood. I'm not sure if it came with a metal one as well. However, I just went out and bought some cheap, uh, a cheap pack. There we go. And it's got lots of different ones for cutting metal and wood. They all use the same connection. I'll show you uh, a little bit later on how they fit in. But it's pretty simple. Now the saw itself. Uh, if I just bring a fraction there, there we go. The saw itself, uh, hard plastic, quite durable, nice red colour. We all like red. Um, it's got a good ergonomic, good good handle. Um, the trigger itself has got safety buttons, and you can push from both sides. So you can see there, so if you're left-handed or right-handed, it doesn't really matter, it just makes it easier for the person doing it. Um, yeah, good rubber handle so you don't lose grip. A couple of bits of rubber around it as well. Nice place so you can hold on while you're cutting down as well. Good rubber, the rest of it is hard plastic. You've got a lock at the front, so when you put your blade in, it will lock into position, uh, it won't come out. Uh, this bit at the front is designed to move and contour whatever you're cutting. So you push it against it, cut away, cut away, cut away. And you can keep it hard against it as it goes down. Because if you're away from it, it could rattle backwards and forwards. So yeah, that's a good little extra. And these things, great for cutting through wood, metal, you name it. Um, a uh, bit better than a jigsaw on some things. Um, if you don't have a, um, a chainsaw or something like that, it will cut through wooden branches, but only to a certain size. It will cut wood, as I say, it will cut everything. So a very good little uh, tool to have around the house. Um, it will cut drywall, anything you need really, and it will cut through. So what I'll quickly do, um, at the end I will have a, a bit showing it on the table where everything is and what things are but to put the blade in so the blades look like this this is a metal cutting metal cutting blade I'm not sure if it is but it's a blade anyway just one of the ones that came with it now to get it in hmm, giggly, um you can't just push it in yeah it will just won't go in but what you've got is this collar let me show you just there try to anyway in the light and it twists and as you twist it yeah it will allow the blade in and then lock it into place so what we'll do is we'll twist it we'll get our blade and you'll notice it's gone all the way down yeah locked into place and now it won't come out yep pretty damn good eh so that's in locked in ready to go and all we need to do now is to put a battery on the back end give me a second set a second and here we have a battery just one from the range slips on pretty easily 
yeah I keep these around and again nothing's going to happen until you press the safety press the safety and this is what it looks like straighten and out reciprocating saw does what it says on the tin pretty good eh um now as i said quite cheap i'll put the price up i get them at my local hardware store uh you can get these i guess in the uk and america under iron hell maybe a zito in the uk definitely in australia and in new zealand if you're going to be cutting anything really and you don't like a jigsaw or circular saw this is a good alternative so here we go this is the zito pcx reciprocating saw good bit of kit